Oui, tout à fait. Moi, je vais le voir passer, mais par contre, le public risque de ne pas le voir passer, tout simplement parce qu'il y a un important dispositif de sécurité. Regardez ces barrières qui sont juste derrière moi. Normalement, il faut se dire que, au niveau des autres commémorations, là devant le Publicis, vous avez des personnes qui peuvent se poster sur les champs élysées Cette fois, eh bien, le dispositif il a été élargi, demande de la préfecture hein, qui a interdit tout rassemblement sur les champs élysées et aux alentours de l'Arc de Triomphe au niveau d'un vaste périmètre de sécurité. Their unparalleled heroism, selflessness, and courage have brought many legendary victims to our motherland. Just like their predecessors, today's servicemen are safeguarding Russia's glorious military tradition by successfully completing the tasks and missions of the special military operation. Comrades, greetings. Happy 78th anniversary of victory in the Great Patriotic War. The Defense Minister has defeated the combined regiment of the Russian Aerospace Force and the Russian Navy. Russian pilots, seamen, and defense and aerospace troops all stand ready to perform their duty and our country's borders at sea and in the skies. Comrades. Happy anniversary of victory in the Great Patriotic War. The Defense Minister is now expecting the parade formations of the railway troops, military police, nuclear, biological, and chemical protection troops, Russia's National Guard, Minister of Emergency Troops, and cadets of the Moscow Fire Combined Arms Command School. Comrades. Happy 78th anniversary of the victory in the Great Patriotic War. Next, the Defense Minister will expect the great formations of the Strategic Missile Force, Airborne Troops, Federal Security Service, National National Cossack Society, female troops, and the youngest parade participants, the cadets of the Sivorov and the Nemo Academies, and later the death war, as well as cadets from the Trostan Lake of Death War. Army General Sergei Shoigu has finished inspecting the parade formations and is now heading to the central stand to report to the Supreme Commander-in-Chief of the Russian Armed Forces, President Vladimir Putin.
Comrade Supreme Commander in Chief of the Armed Forces of the Russian Federation, the troops of the Moscow garrison are ready for the Victory Day Parade. Defense Minister Shoigu reporting. 